God, help me to want, to want, to want to pray this prayer. (laughs) Ha ha, here we go. Hi, my name is Father Mike Schmitz and this is Essential Presents. So a while back, I was uh, on one of the Sunday homilies. I had invited people to begin praying this prayer called the Litany of Humility. And it is by Cardinal Mary Duvall. It is remarkable. It is an incredible, incredible prayer. Um, It's also a really difficult prayer to pray. In fact, it's so difficult that many people, both our students and people online, reached out and they said, Father, I don't think I can pray that prayer. Like, I literally don't think I can pray that prayer because if I prayed the prayer, I would be lying. Like, I actually don't want what this prayer is asking for. And I think, I thought, like, that's really good. That's really honest. A, it's really honest. And B, the fact that all these people who reached out were kind of troubled, troubled by that. Like, oh, I don't, uh, I don't even want this. I don't want to pray. That I thought, I think, we, I think this would be worth passing along. So back in the day, the founder of the Jesuits, St. Ignatius of Loyola, he had a prayer. It's called the Susipe, Susipe, Susipe. Anyways, it's, it's this prayer that's, it's, I don't know, I think that's Latin. Where he says, take Lord, my memory, take my understanding, take my will. Um, take basically, take everything. Take all my gifts, take everything. I'm really paraphrasing right now. But it's basically this, this Lord, I don't desire either wealth or poverty. I don't desire health or sickness. I don't desire a long life or a short one. Basically, it's just, just give me yourself and that's enough for me. It's this this prayer of surrender and it's beautiful. And people will come to Ignatius and say, essentially, I can't pray that prayer. (laughs) He says, okay, no problem. Here's 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 the key. Pray as you can, not as you can't. What's that mean? Well, it means this. So here's this prayer, the litany of humility or this prayer of Ignatius of Loyola. Pray this. God, help me to help me to pray this prayer. I can't pray the prayer. I can't pray the litany of humility. So God, help me to pray this prayer. People come back and say, well, yeah, but I don't even want to. Great. Pray as you can, not as you can't. Say, God, help me to want to pray this prayer. And people, some people will be able to do that, right? They say, okay, God, I'm going to pray to want. Help me to change my heart. Help me to want to pray this prayer. Some people would come back and say, I, I don't know that I actually want to be able to pray this prayer. I don't even know if I want to pray this prayer. And he says, okay, then pray as you can, not as you can't. Go back to the Lord and say, okay, God, help me to want, to want to pray this prayer. That sense of this being able to realize that God wants you to come before him. Yes, every one of us has the capacity to grow in the spiritual life. Like every one of us, we're not there. None of us are there. So we need to grow. And just to be honest and realize, okay, I don't know if I want to grow. God, I know that your saints are those who just say yes to you. I, I don't even know if I want to say yes to you. To begin your prayer by simply being honest about that is a great way to begin your prayer. To say, okay, this is where I'm at. I can pray as I can. I can't pray as I can't. So pray as you can, not as you can't. But we have to always make sure that that prayer is honest, not a false face. Too often, too often, too many of us come before God and we tell God what we think he wants to hear. Too often we come before God and we present the, the part of our heart before God that we think he would be happy with. Too often we come before God and we give him the face, right? The face that um, we think he prefers. But it's a false prayer. It's a false heart. It's a false face. It's a false self. And the truth is, God doesn't love that version of your heart. He doesn't love that version of your face. He doesn't love that version of yourself because that version doesn't exist. It's not real. He loves your actual heart. He loves your actual face. He loves your actual self. And so because of that, because of that, we have to come before him with our actual heart, with our true face, with our true self. And so if I look at the litany of humility, or look at the, that surrender prayer of St. Ignatius, and I can't pray it, and I, or I don't even want to pray it, or I don't even want to want to pray it. Be honest. Bring your true heart before the Lord. God, I, I, I'm afraid. I'm afraid that if I ask for humility, you're going to give it to me. God, I'm afraid that if I, I pray this prayer, that you're going to take everything away from me. Okay, then be honest. Tell him that. Reveal that to him. Entrust that. I mean, he already knows, right? But when we pray in, the, in that honest way, we're entrusting that to him. Pray as you can, not as you can't. And just begin. Anyways, for all of us here to Sensor Presents, my name is Father Mike. God bless.